M0 FXB Digital Ham Radio Diary. Welcome. M0 FXB, welcome to my channel. So we've got our little Bofeng T1 here and the cables come. And I thought before I actually load the driver, there's a CD in the box. I'm going to just try and see if my Windows 11 will even recognize it. So the cable does say Bofeng on it. Got this from eBay. I'll put a link in. And then it's just got a micro USB which plugs in here. So we're gonna take the flap down like so and put it in and then we're gonna plug it in the PC and see if we if it installs the driver on its own. It's, should we turn it on? So let's turn it on. So hold the top like so. Now we haven't done this yet, it's the first time, but it is fully charged. So we've turned it on and then we're gonna plug it into our PC and see why the PC did make a noise. So uh, let's just right click a minute and have a look. So we'll just right click here, device manager, and see what it says. Double click ports, um, yeah, USB serial CH340 COM10 is showing. Right, well that's good, let's go on to, uh, it looks like it doesn't need the driver installing on Windows 11. So this is where we get our software from, I'll put the link in, and we go down to BFT1, download, and you'll get a zip and then just run it. When you run it, you get this program here, now the cable is connected. So, let's um, for now just read the radio, uh, we need to set the correct com, so go over to set, communication port and it is top com 10 i just saw that in device manager here let me show you again double click there it is there usb serial ch340 com 10 so we'll select com 10 like so um, we have to open this wider click ok and now let's go file and then read read data click read yeah nice and fast and it's got the channels that are already on the radio. So let's try and load something on here. Um, let's just put in my all-star node. So we'll just, and then we'll do a test. So we'll go 434.550, CTS 77. Uh, really, we just need it on ENCODE. So we'll leave that off. And we'll do it on ENCODE, so otherwise we won't hear it. The, the the node so we'll go 77 on enco which is transmit uh, we'll leave it on white for now uh, so that's on channel uh, it says on relay channel just to be sure because I don't know what relay is I'm going to put it on number one four three four dot five five zero tx frequency the same four three four dot five five so it looks like you don't put in shifts you just put in uh, TX and RX, leave it on narrow. And we're going to save, so we've got a copy of this, a file save, and we'll just call it my B, is it F dash T1? That's what we'll call it. Then we'll go save, and then we'll write that to the radio. Write that to radio. And we'll just see that it's gone in there on number one. Yes, it has. And then we'll we'll move on to testing. Okay, we're here and we're on the node. G7 RPG node, which is in my house. And it's sounding pretty good. Let's just go volume one. Push the volume here and up oh, one. So what we'll do, we might try and get an audio report. Yeah, they're, they're having a good chat there, so I think we'll do that in a separate video. But yeah, seems to be working fine, programming lead. And I'll come back later with more videos on the Bofang Mini BFT173. All the best.